what's up guys i'm back here with another video this time i'm going to show you guys all the disney videos that i've been collecting over the past couple of months because i've heard on the internet i don't know whether it's true or not that these clamshell uh vhs uh disney movies are going to be worth a lot of money in the future so me being the great investor that i am i am here to show you guys what i picked up over the last couple of months yes these are not uh old time uh vhs's that i have had in my collection these are recently i just bought them at the drift store uh, the goodwill the salvation army and another drift store that's around here and um yeah i've got them for cheaper like 50 cents or a dollar a pop and you never know, they might be worth in the future. I, I, I hear that they are, and I hear that they're not. So I don't know if they're just pieces of shits and they're not going to be worth, or if they are going to be worth, who knows. But anyways, um, I picked up um, The Lion King Part 2. This is Simba, Simba's uh, Pride. I've never seen this movie in my entire life. I am not a Disney fan, and I don't have a lot of Disney movies over, uh, here in my... Uh, in my collection but um yeah this is uh the the lion king part two symbols pride wonder if it's any good or not i don't really care but um it was available and it's in the clamshell it's a pretty good shape you know but uh yeah vhs man so i got here uh disney's beauty and the beast the enchanted christmas an all-new movie i guess this is like a sequel to the beauty and the beast I'm not sure what this is, and I'm not sure if it's worth any kind of money out there. But maybe not now, but in the future it might be. Um, this runs at 72 minutes, and I'm not sure what year this came out in. But yeah, it's a, it's a different uh, Beauty and the Beast uh, story. Again, uh, Fantasia 2000. I'm not familiar with none of these Disney titles, but um, hopefully it's a good one. I doubt that I'll ever uh, dust off my VHS to see this. I'm just, you know, I'm just a hoarder. I just collect shit from all over the place. If it's movies or uh, video games, um, I want to have it. I want to get it. And um, I remember this one as a kid watching this. This was a tearjerker. This is a really, really fantastic movie. If you've never seen this, this is called... The Fox and the Hound, very, very good, very, very sad. If one day you just want to be, uh, you know, feeling sad, I mean, I don't even know why would you feel sad. Well, why would you want to feel sad? But this is a very, very sad, very um, emotional movie. The Fox and the Hound. And uh, this is uh, the Black Diamond, uh, the classic. On the side, it has a Black Diamond. And I'm not sure if it's worth anything, but I picked it up for like 50 cents and... I like these clamshells, man. They used to be really, really cool. They bring back a lot of memories when I was a kid. Now, this is not a Disney movie, but it's in a clamshell. So, I, I, I don't know. I just picked it up. This is uh, Free Willy Part 2. The Adventure Home. I think I... I want to say I've seen this before a very, very long time ago. Of course, I remember the first one very, very well. But I believe I did see the sequel. But I'm not 100% sure. So, I can't really comment on that. Then I got Peter Pan, the special edition here. Um, this this one this one seems to be in pretty good shape, and inside as well, it's in pretty good shape. And yeah, man, these are really cool. It has those special features, digital e digitally restored and remastered, and you can fly the making of Peter Pan. It, it's weird how they had uh, special features on on VHS. I wonder how that works. Maybe at the end of the movie, the special features will, will run. I'm not sure how that works, but this runs at 77 minutes. And I'm not sure what year this, this baby came out. But uh, Peter Pan's an old, old story. So Then I got the original Beauty and the Beast, which uh, this is actually my daughter's favorite princess, uh, Belle. And um, it's a really cool story about, you know, the prince that uh, he turns into a beast, he gets cursed, and then he has to find true love. Uh, and he finally find it with, found it with Belle, and then he became a, a good-looking prince again. And 
they lived happily ever after. It's a it's a really cool tale with a uh, very uh, interesting characters like Lumineer and Gaston and a bunch of others. This runs at 84 minutes, and it's a really good story, really good uh, animation in this movie. You can hear, you can see the back of it. This is definitely one of the top uh, Disney uh, classics. And I got Tarzan here, which is not that old, not that old of a movie. I I I'm, I want to say like maybe the late. 90s early 2000s i don't know why they don't they don't say the dates that it was released it just says the time 88 89 minutes so yeah so this is tarzan the disney version of Tar tarzan and yeah it was pretty popular back when it came out you know they even had a video game on it and all that stuff so it's a cool uh, addition to my collection here then this i've never heard this is the, the disney masterpieces the adventures of Ichabod, Ichabod and Mr. Toad, 50th year anniversary, this one came out in 1950, running at 68 minutes, I have no clue what this is, I've never seen it in my life, again, I'm not a huge Walt Disney World uh, fan here, so I don't know much about this, or what this is about, but I picked it up because it was there, and I picked up everything that was in that uh, Goodwill, it was a Goodwill and the Salvation Army then I got Dumbo here this, who hasn't seen this I've seen this, so yeah, this is a special 60th anniversary which it's a lot more now because this 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 actually came out in 1941 so 1941 animation, so it's really 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 cool to see a 1941 movie being restored on VHS and then on DVD and then on Blu-ray and who knows we might see it on 4k one day but yeah Dumbo's a classic tale it's been passed through generations and generations it's a timeless classic for for uh, children of all ages and you know really really cool stuff here with uh, Dumbo the magical elephant that flies here you got uh, the, the Emperor's new groove I want to say this is another movie that's not that old, maybe the late 90s, early 2000s. And uh, yeah, man, this is, uh, you know, I, I can't tell you what this is about because I've never seen it, to be honest. But I picked it up for like 50 cents. And um, who knows, maybe in the future it's going to be worth. And it's a, it's, a, it's a cool, it's cool when you see all these clamshells together like that. Like it, 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 it looks pretty cool on the, on the, on the shelf. Then I got my all-time favorite, Disney all-time favorite version of Robin Hood and this is the Fox Robin Hood badass badass I don't know if you guys are old enough to remember this but this is a classic man I used to love this this uh, movie here it runs at 83 minutes and God knows what year this shit came out but man I used to love Robin Hood and and you know this animation and brings back a lot of memories when I was a kid I've seen this movie more than a hundred times I really, really love this. I had to get both versions of it. I don't know which one's the alternate cover. I remember seeing this cover more often. So I'm assuming that this is not the, the original cover. Although this one says the gold collection. So I'm kind of confused which one's the real cover of this. But um, definitely Robin Hood. The Disney version of Robin Hood was fantastic. I loved it. My, my Probably my favorite Disney movie of all time. When it comes to animation. Then I got here Aladdin. Of course this one came out in 92. I remember this one vividly. I remember playing the Sega Genesis game for it. It was amazing. Really, really good. Has a really good story. Really good action. Has action. Great animation. Robin Williams was amazing at playing the genie. And it was really, really entertaining. Really awesome, awesome movie. I can't recommend this anymore. Um, I'm sure everybody has seen this. Aladdin. Fantastic. And I'm glad I found it. For cheap price then i got the three caballeros and uh this this was actually pretty entertaining i remember this as well too the three caballeros with donald duck and uh panchito i remember panchito is one of them and i can't remember the other one's name but yeah man this is a timeless classic for sure must have in your disney collection as well as 101 dalmatian really really cool uh this is the masterpiece uh version of it and um i want to say this came out in the early 90s probably 91 i want to say and yeah it's 101 dalmatians man you can't go wrong with this one 
I had to pick this one up when I saw it. It's got to be worth something in the future. And of course, the Little Mermaid was there as well. So I picked it up. The Little Mermaid actually, if I had to pick uh, my favorite princess, it would have to be the Little Mermaid. Brings back a lot of memories. I've seen this a lot. I remember watching this as a kid when I, when I used to go to that daycare I used to go to. They used to play this movie all the time. And I, I enjoyed this, uh, The Little Mermaid. Very, very good movie. And uh, the animation on it, fantastic. The soundtrack, very, very good. And then I got here Walt Disney Masterpiece Fun and Fancy Free. Um, I want to say this is a compilation of uh, Mickey Mouse Adventures with his buddies Goofy and Donald Duck. And yeah, man, this I've never seen this. I've never even heard of this. But um, definitely picked it up. Fully restored 50th anniversary. So this shit has to be old, old, old. Yeah. And last but not least in this collection of clamshells for VHS. Uh, my VHS Walt Disney World collection. The Goofy movie. Um, what can I say about this? I really, really enjoyed Goof Troop. And... Uh, it used to be my uh, my channel 33, which was a uh, WBFS, and they used to play uh, the afternoon cartoons, uh, Disney afternoon cartoons, with it had uh, Chip and Dale, Tailspin, Darkwing Duck, DuckTales, and Goof Troop. And they actually made a movie of the Goofy movie. And man, I used to, I used to love that, that part of Disney. I really, really enjoyed. Chip and Dale's was awesome. DuckTales was awesome. Tailspin amazing and dark wind dog and then came goofy with goof troop really really awesome uh memories as you know as me growing up and those i'm never gonna forget those cartoons so yeah man go a goofy movie that's about it for this collection on uh, my vhs uh disney clamshell collection which i haven't been collecting for a very long time i just picked them up not too long ago but um, hopefully they're worth in the future. You never know. I'd rather be on the safe side. I bought all these clamshell VHS for about, I want to say like maybe like 10, 15 bucks, all of these. So I think I got a pretty good deal. Maybe I just wasted my money. Maybe they're pieces of shits and they're not going to be worth anything in the future. But maybe they are. You never know. Um, anyways, it looks very, very cool on display. Let me show you. Give you an example, for example. Like that, it looks really, really fucking dope on anybody's um, DVD shelf. And yeah, man, I'm, I'm proud and happy to get these for a very, very cheap price. And um, I know, I know it's it's getting hard to find these because I've been I've been driving around, you know, the, the local Goodwill and Salvation Army and a couple of stores there that they sell used stuff. And um, I, I don't, I'm not finding them anymore. So maybe they are gonna be worth maybe a lot of people are starting to buy them again you know I, I i keep on hearing that everybody's getting into vhs again nowadays so you never know but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys around and start buying all these uh vhs these clamshells of, of disney they might be worth in the future you never know these are relics antiques and they're gonna they're only gonna get older and older and older the older they get the more rare it is to find them and they might be worth a lot of money in the future if i was you and if you see these stores around here go buy go do yourself a favor and if you see these clamshells go buy them because i believe that they're going to be worth in the future all right guys until next time i'll see you around bye